I'm often asked why study A-level maths. Well, we're a tiny island that's part of a global economy. The UK is one of a few countries in the world where the study of maths is not compulsory after the age of 16. Students will be competing for jobs with people who have studied maths at least up to the age of 18, especially if they're considering studying or working abroad. Creative and technological advances will make maths more important than ever and this is why jobs that require math skills tend to pay more. Now the A-level is made up of two parts, the pure maths and the applied maths. Pure maths covers things like algebra, trigonometry and calculus. The applied maths covers both statistics and mechanics. Now further maths takes in some additional pure maths, mechanics and statistics and the option of covering decision maths. Now, there are plenty of jobs that use mathematics. So if you're considering game designing, engineering, animating, statistician, analysts, those kind of jobs all require good math skills. But other A-levels also need good math skills. Geography, economics, business, biology, psychology and PE also have some maths in them. So it's very much a case of choose maths because it will help you with all of your other subjects as well as give you an advantage in the budding workforce where you'll need to shine in front of everybody else. Hi, my name is Emily Newby and I take maths at the grammar school. I find it's a good subject to help me get where I want to go. I want to go into computing at university for games development, and I think it can really help. It ties in well with my other subjects, such as physics, and the teachers here are really nice, and I think it's a great place to be. Um, I used to struggle with trigonometry and the soccer toa stuff a lot, but the teachers at the grammar school, like Ms. Cooper, make things a lot simpler to understand, and it's really great for helping get good for your exams. Hello, I'm Kishore and I'm a current Year 12 Maths and Further Maths student in Boston Grammar School. Maths and Further Maths give you a skill set that can be applied in a wide variety of fields and are used from everything from electronics to uh, space design. Maths and Further Maths also open up a large number of doors for university courses. An advantage of further maths especially is that you get to pick your module, extra modules. You can pick a variety of modules like statistics, decision, maths and um, mechanics. And since you get to pick, you can optimise it for the careers you're interested in. And you get to do what you actually enjoy and you can skip out the bits you don't like. For example, you might find stats boring, there's always mechanics. And if you find uh, the, the applications in mechanics boring, you can do decision maths, which is useful in computer science and many logistics companies value that skill set very highly. Um, another advantage of um, normal maths is the skill set you get from maths is easily applicable to physics, chemistry and biology as well. So if you're doing any other sciences or technical or sciences or scientific subjects in general, 
it's very useful and skill sets you gain can be applied to pretty much any other subject. And plus, um, normal maths also comes with a statistics section, which can be used in other sciences as well, since statistics decides a lot about um, a lot of decisions in the real world are made using statistics and statistical analysis, and all that um, boosts what you can do for boosts your ability to work in any field and do whatever you want. After A-levels at BGS, I'm considering either doing medicine or maths. And if I'm doing maths, obviously maths and further maths are very good for maths. And if I'm doing medicine, the statistics aspects of maths naturally fits very naturally fits very effectively into studying medicine. And um, any other further math skills can always be applied in other things. And since so much of what's around us is based on maths, having the skill set is a very optimal thing to have for any career in general.